Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. This is the Pigalu here and today I'm going to do a review on a product that you guys have been requesting and that is these Krylon concealers. I bought these back in uh, January when I went to Mumbai. So I've been using these two for about two months. The first confession is the price and this one retails for about uh, 350 rupees for 4 grams and this one retails for about 200 rupees for this small pan of 4 ml and that is 0.14 fluid ounce so this is really really less but i think this will run you for a really long time i feel the price is decent because these if compared to other concealers are the cheapest one of the cheapest even though you get really less amount these will run you for a really long time so this is totally worth it so the second confession is the packaging this one comes in a small tube like this where you can open and then close this is really really easy to carry around because you can definitely put it in your makeup bag for like even daily use or when you're traveling and it's really safe this is a cream so it won't even explode or stuff like that so it's even safe to take on an airplane but this one i have a problem with this is that this is a small sample size you get the bigger version which is about thousand to one thousand two hundred rupees uh, I didn't buy that because I didn't know if I will like this or not so I wanted to test out the formula first and then go ahead and buy the bigger version but after using this and compared to this I don't know if I'll actually go ahead and use the uh, I mean buy the bigger version the problem with the smaller version is that this comes in a small uh, container like this and you don't get any type of casing like you get with this if you have an empty palette you can put this inside that or else this will kind of be a problem to store so what i did to store this product is that i had this lacme compact empty compact so i put this thing inside this and closed it so this kind of uh, stores and doesn't allow any bacteria to go inside so whenever i require i open this use it and then close it again so this kind of works out for me right now these both are made in germany and the one thing that i really like about this uh, small one is that there's a leaflet on the back which tells all the items that have been included in this product uh, to make this product i mean so that's a really good thing but this one does not really have i think the carton outside carton maybe had that products but this uh, tube doesn't have so i'm really impressed with this and if you guys want to know the shades it's down in the description box below you guys can definitely go ahead and check that out third confession is the quality and i like this better than this because the pros for this kind of outrun this one first pro about these products is its coverage this one is really really high coverage with just one swipe you get the perfect amount of coverage you want if you want a little bit more you can definitely layer it down it does not look cakey and all this is very appropriate for weddings and functions like that because this does have a little bit of thick consistency so it provides a really uh, thick layer of your product but this one on the other hand has a light coverage compared to the other one you do have to layer it on twice or thrice maybe like to get the perfect amount of coverage this does have a little bit of white kind of tinge when you apply so you do have to kind of blend it out very nicely so that that thing goes away but uh, the one thing that i really really like about this uh, concealer compared to this is that this does kind of give you that glow under your under eye because this does have that brightening effect so i like to apply this on a triangle basis then blend it out but this one does not have any type of brightening sort of a finish to it it just is a plain old concealer which does a really good job of covering all your dark spots or uh, blackness this is the derma color camouflage cream and i'm in the shade d64 in this and i'm in the shade fs 45 in this i like to apply this concealer with a concealer brush because it's not very thick it does move around a lot so i like to use this with the concealer brush because that gives me exact amount of coverage it does a really good job of blending it out and i think even if you try to uh, apply this with your hand it does kind of leave a little bit of marks and i do not like that so apply with a concealer brush and pat it instead of dragging it 
that will avoid any type of brush marks on your skin so yeah you have to be a little careful and you do have to get used to how to use this when you apply this with a brush you get a lot more coverage than when you apply it with your hand so i would definitely recommend you guys to use a brush with this but when you're using this i would definitely recommend you guys to use your hands because this thing works really well with your hands as compared to a brush if you're not really comfortable with blending out your concealer with your hands then you can apply this with your uh, hand wherever you need it and then blend it out with a makeup sponge or a brush that also works out with this but do not try to pick up the product with your brush that won't really work out really well because the product is really thick and you won't get as much product onto your brush as you want and you will kind of end up wasting the product instead of actually using it after you apply this and blend it out it does go kind of matte so if you have dry skin you don't really need to pat it down with a powder you can directly skip that it won't crease but if you have oily skin and oily kind of uh, under eye area then i would recommend you guys to pat it with a powder but for this one the cream is not really thick it does tend to kind of move around and crease when you sweat or you have uh, fine lines there so i would definitely recommend you guys to set it with a powder no matter what type of skin you have may be oily or dry set it with the powder so that it stays like that for a really long time i would definitely recommend you guys to try out this concealer because this is my favorite so far i've been loving using this once i started using this i'm not even trying to uh, touch any other concealer that i have i really like this i think you guys can get cryolon products in cryolon stores there's in chennai mumbai and uh, delhi i guess I'm not really sure any other areas but I would definitely link their website down below so you guys can directly go ahead and check out where you can get it in Mumbai you can also get Kralon products in like beauty centers so you guys can check that out as well So that was my review guys. I hope you guys liked it and you enjoyed my review. I would definitely recommend you guys to buy the Derma color range. If you are someone who wants really thick high coverage cream, it's really good. It blends in very nicely. I love this one, so I would definitely recommend you this. But if you are someone who's just starting out and want something that's light coverage and for daily usage, then go for this. The smaller version can be really uh, messy and like takes up time to like storage and stuff but if you want to invest mm, like a good amount then go for the bigger version that's about 1000 but if not then you can definitely use this because this small pot if used daily will come for about 3 to 6 months i think yeah more than that maybe so you need very little of it anyways it will do a brightening and concealing both in one But uh, if you are someone who wants really good coverage for daily day basis, you can go ahead with this. But I would definitely recommend you guys to use only this for functions and uh, parties, and not bother with this because this does kind of uh, move around a bit. So don't go for this. That's it for today, guys. I hope you like this video. If you do, then do not forget to give it a thumbs up and share this video so that other girls can know what are the concealers they can try out. And also, do not forget to uh, follow me on my Twitter, Snapchat, and Instagram. I'm really active there. You can see what I'm doing on a daily -day basis. And also, I'm trying to do as many requests as possible. If I'm not able to do anything, then do not forget. I will make sure I'll do it in the future. And yeah. 
that's it for today see you in my next video bye bye